Okay, folks, here we are. We're starting. One thing you do is you pop off your clips on your drain pan. You remove your support filter rail. It opens the cabinet up a little bit. You slide it out very cautiously so you don't crack the drain pan. Pull the drain pan off. And then Raphael will put the coil down somewhere. Now what they're going to do is they're going to pull off the plate on the top real quick. One thing uh, I wanted to point out earlier as I discussed is, as you saw, this bracket was supporting the drain pan right here. So that is the most common thing that does not get flipped. So you can see the, uh, the plate on the inside right here. This is what gets the water and runs it into the drain tubes. On uh, this one, this is a water management kit if you put another tube over here. But anyhow, they're going to go ahead and flip it. And it's pretty much that simple. We put the plate back in the top. That's the filler plate. It's easier just to drop it down there, to be honest with you. It doesn't stick in there. This is an important step right here. Make sure you don't put a hole in the coil. Make sure the screws actually line up, especially when using a drill. All right, now what we're going to do is get the support bracket. If you go, no, five sixteenths. Make sure you put your drain tube back on, too. It's very important. This is a very, very important step that gets left out, I'd say 99% of the time, it seems like. Now what we did is, as y'all saw, we took off the filter door so the cabinet will stretch a little bit so you don't put, uh, you don't put too much pressure on the core and the drain pan putting it back in because it is a tricky process to say the least. It, uh, Bryant and Carrier drain pans, they're good pans but they are fragile just like with anything. So as you can see, he's putting it back on, getting things lined up. Now you got to make sure your clips, you, go. you make sure that the clips are back in the door. Filter track goes back on, but you can see right here that your clips are holding the coil in. Right there, and right there, right there. You can also see that the support bracket, these two screws are now missing over here in the filter track, which uh, tells you that they did not put the drain pan support bracket in place. But uh, that's pretty much it. The rest of it's common sense. Uh, if you have any issues, 
with the uh, Bryant or Carrier system, then uh, and you're in the Hilton Head, Bluffton, Defusky area, please contact Hans Air Specialist. Uh, we'll be happy to come out and take a look. You can reach us at 843-683-4242. Just another quick reminder that you see at this plate is now on this side, so when it's laying in the cabinet, um, it's a horizontal right application that uh, you won't have any water issues. Um, anyway, thank you.